90% of all goods traded internationally travel by sea. Over 6 billion tons a year. In ships of all shapes and sizes. Bulk carriers, tankers, container ships, and many more. But whatever the size and type, and whatever the cargo, those ships must be turned around quickly. And increasing competition, ever-changing markets, growing environmental concerns, and the threat of international terrorism have created more demands on ports than ever before. Maritime trade is and always has been vital to the United Kingdom. Its long and eventful maritime history coupled with its extensive coastline, has helped it develop the largest, busiest, and most diverse ports industry in Europe. It has many of the world's most sophisticated ports, from container ports and terminals for oil, gas, and bulk goods, through to passenger facilities for ferries and cruise liners. The UK port industry is thriving. For many overseas governments and companies, Port owners and operators are faced with many complex factors when deciding on the type, location and capacity of facilities to meet future demand. The United Kingdom is the world's greatest financial and legal center. Specialist institutions serving the maritime industry include the Baltic Exchange, the only established and self-regulated global marketplace for shipbrokers, as well as Lloyd's of London and the world's biggest insurance sector. The country's leading bankers, accountants, insurers and lawyers all played key roles in the transition of the domestic ports industry from state ownership to public-private partnerships. It transformed the industry. Today, Investment in capital projects comes from the private sector, not the public purse. The UK's unrivaled expertise in financial and legal services is now available to governments around the world who want to develop the right financial model for their ports.
Who's coming into the country? What's in these containers? Whether combating terrorism, the avoidance of excise duties, or illegal immigration, having the right infrastructure is vital.